Hello and welcome to the coolest tutorial of Python. This is Pitfumes and I'm your host Sarthak and in this episode we are going to learn about the assignment operator. We have seen the glimpse of assignment operator which is equal to in the last episode but let's now deep dive into this. So you know in the morning I go to the shop and purchases four bananas. Two for me and two for my sister. So let's type that. So bananas okay and i got four that's good but uh, when i came back to home i realized that okay my dad also want to eat banana so what i have done i go there to the shop again and i purchase two more banana so what i can say like bananas is equal to because i already have uh, the bananas four bananas so i will say bananas but this time I purchased two more. So in total, I have six bananas. That's good. So let's see uh, if I print this. So print bananas and let's run this. Yeah, four. But if I print bananas after this line, we expect six, which is good. But as I came back home again i realized that my dad just need one banana and my sister refuses to eat banana so i need to return three bananas so it's like bananas is equal to bananas minus three because one for my dad and two for my sister so i have to return three bananas okay that's good so let's print once more banana bananas here now this time i have three <laughs> this is good but you know the assignment operator is doing some crazy thing what this statement is doing here we are using banana equal to four so we have created a variable we have assigned it for the value four number four inside this variable this is easy statement we have seen that but this time what it is doing it is just using banana the same variable name and it is reassigning reassigning bananas means the older value of banana which is 4 plus 2 okay so got the point so this assignment operator equal to not just assigns whatever it's on the right of it it just calculate first on the right of the assignment operator then put value to the container or we call it variable similarly here we are using banana so this is not the banana of first second line not this one the banana here we are using on the ninth line is the banana on sixth line and this one on the left one okay so this means it just calculate this part and then assign to this part this means the banana so finally we have this line which saying banana remains is three on my side this is good but you know python makes these things more more easy how you can just escape because you are using same variable name so why write two times so here inside this we can say banana plus equal to two so what this is statement this is exactly same to this statement so if i comment this and i will say bananas plus equal to it is same let's run it okay so i don't need to give a space here because as i have told you python is space sensitive okay so now six again so it's same this line is same as this line so i think you guessed it right you can use minus three here so we have four six three let's run once more four six three same result so this is assignment operators and we have used this so i think you guessed it right we can use multiply also this means banana is equal to banana multiply by 3. So think about this. We have 6 here. 6 banana, 6 3 is 18. So we should expect 18. That's good. And similarly, we can use double star 
to uh, raise to the power so or exponential operator so 6 to the power 3 that means 6 into 6 into 6 is 216 similarly we know we can use divide equal to yeah this is good and if i use double yeah dot zero is gone decimal place is gone only integer then we can use modulus also and six mod three is zero we know because it is exactly divisible so these are the assignment operator used in python and if you have not subscribed to this channel please go and subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get instant notification and like bitfumes on facebook twitter instagram share these video with your friends and we will meet in the next episode till then Goodbye.